Welcome to the SoundGrid 201 certification training. In this short video series, we'll dive deeper into SoundGrid, what it is, its concepts, the components of the SoundGrid system, and various use cases for a SoundGrid system. Before we begin, please note that you are required to complete the SoundGrid 101 course before taking the SoundGrid 201 certification test. Let's jump right in, starting with a quick recap of what we've learned in the SoundGrid 101 course. SoundGrid is a protocol for real-time audio processing and networking that uses standard Ethernet infrastructure. It's used for recording and mixing in studio settings, at front of house and monitors positions in live sound, radio, TV, streaming, and various other audio use cases. The SoundGrid platform encompasses hardware devices such as SoundGrid audio interfaces, SoundGrid DSP servers, and SoundGrid host software such as the Emotion LV1 mixer, for example. Let's talk about the components that make up a SoundGrid system. A basic SoundGrid system must contain the following components. A Windows or Mac computer running a SoundGrid host application, a SoundGrid compatible audio interface, a SoundGrid DSP server, and a SoundGrid compatible Ethernet switch. So as you can see, a SoundGrid system contains both hardware and software components. First, let's dive deeper into what role each hardware component plays in the SoundGrid ecosystem. A SoundGrid host computer is a standard Windows or Mac computer used to control SoundGrid software and manage the SoundGrid network. This computer is used to run SoundGrid host applications the Emotion LV1 mixer, the Multirec plugin rack, or SoundGrid Studio. A SoundGrid I.O. device is an audio interface. It converts whatever audio signal, whether analog or digital, to the SoundGrid audio protocol. SoundGrid I.O.s range from two input interfaces such as the DigiCrit D, to robust 128-channel audio interfaces such as the DigiGrid MGB and MGO SoundGrid 2 MADI interfaces. SoundGrid I.O. devices support sample rates up to 96 kHz at 24-bit. They are connected to the SoundGrid network via Ethernet cables. A SoundGrid DSP server is a number cruncher designed to take the processing load off of your computer. Audio in the SoundGrid network runs through the server and it's processed with SoundGrid-compatible plugins. The server provides low-latency audio turnaround, thus allowing time-critical applications such as real-time tracking with effects, mixing massive sessions and using many plugins in studio settings, using SoundGrid plugins with your physical live console via Multirack, and even running live shows using the Emotion LV1 software mixer at front of house, monitors, or both. A SoundGrid compatible Ethernet switch is a gigabit Ethernet switch qualified by WAVES for use in a SoundGrid network. It links the host computer, the server, and all SoundGrid I.O. devices. A list of qualified switches can be found on WAVES.com. The network of all SoundGrid hardware devices is managed using SoundGrid host application software running on the host computer. Let's go over the different SoundGrid applications currently available. SoundGrid Studio is a virtual studio mixer designed to be the core of the studio. It enables recording and monitoring at ultra-low latency with plugins and creating up to eight individual headphone mixes. Multirec is designed especially for live sound applications and enables traditional mixing consoles to use plugins in real time. Multirec provides up to 64 software racks, mono, stereo, or surround, and is similar to outboard hardware processing racks. Emotion LV1 is a fully-featured live mixer with up to 64 input channels, 
mono or stereo, and up to 35 output mix buses divided into groups, auxiliaries, matrices, and mains. LV1's channel strips feature a plugin rack that can host up to eight SoundGrid compatible plugins for real-time processing. And it also comes preloaded with three plugins specifically designed for live sound. Emo F2 filter, Emo D5 dynamics, and Emo Q4 equalizer. Alongside the SoundGrid host applications, let's touch on a few additional SoundGrid software components. Studio Rack is a cross-platform plugin rack used within digital audio workstations that runs chains of up to eight SoundGrid-compatible plugins. It can operate in local mode, in which the plugin chain is processed on the local CPU, or in SoundGrid mode, in which processing of the plugin chain takes place on the SoundGrid server. The SoundGrid driver is a software interface that allows digital audio workstations to use any SoundGrid I.O. for audio recording, playback, and MIDI recording. It supports up to 128 channels. The SoundGrid driver is compatible with Windows using ASIO and with Mac using Core Audio. One last thing to mention. We said that to build a SoundGrid system, you must have a SoundGrid server and a SoundGrid I.O. device. But in fact, you can enjoy one of the benefits of SoundGrid, namely DSP offloading, even if you don't have a SoundGrid-compatible interface. SoundGrid Connect is a feature of the SoundGrid driver that makes non-SoundGrid ASIO or Core Audio audio interfaces speak the SoundGrid language. SoundGrid Connect is designed to be used in the studio for mixing in situations where low latency is not essential. It makes it possible to offload plugin processing to a SoundGrid servers even without a SoundGrid I.O., as well as adding such audio interfaces to an existing SoundGrid network for sharing and streaming audio. In the next video in this training series, we'll discuss how clocking works in a SoundGrid system. Click on the card above or go to waves.com soundgrid-201 to watch the next video.